Hey everybody, Jem Schofield of the C47 and another episode of Gearbox 2.0. In this episode, we're gonna be talking about this little black box and whether or not it's going to help me and you take away some of the insanity that you might be having when you're using devices like this and this and this. So let's get started. All right, boys and girls, it's less than two days away from what is my favorite holiday here in the US of A, which is Thanksgiving. It is an important time for me because while I was growing up, Christmas was the holiday, and of course I wanted those presents. But for me, Thanksgiving is that time of year where I get to be with family, I get to be with friends. There's generally no agenda, though that agenda can creep in sometimes. It is family of course, so there you go. Uh, so we've got a lot of people coming over, there's a lot to prep, and I'm gonna bang out this episode of Gearbox this week to go over something that has been driving me a little bit nutty over the last few years. So, in front of me, I have probably one of the pieces of kit that I use more than any other besides my cameras and lights, and that is audio kit, and that is wireless transmitters and receivers, and I have ones here from Rode, and I have ones here from Sony. These are the two main systems I use, the Filmmaker Kit and the UWP series, and guess what? Every single one of these little suckers here, I take out these trays, and what do they have inside of them? They have double A batteries. And I have to say, and here they are here in the filmmaker kit, that I am always terrified of my batteries running out when I am in production. So a number of years ago, I said, you know, I'm gonna invest in some rechargeable batteries. And I did so, I used them a little while, I wasn't really happy with them. And I said, I'm gonna revisit this whole area now and see what is out there on the market. So after doing a lot of research, I found that the Panasonic Eneloop Pros, which are 2,550 milliamp hours, so they've got juice. These are designed for electronic devices, are some of the best rated batteries out there on the market. So what I did is I went to Amazon and I found this kit here, which I like very much. In fact, I could see myself buying a second one of these if this works out. And this kit has inside of it a charger for four batteries. And they don't just have to be double A's. You can put the triple A's that come with this kit inside of there, which I use sometimes for my light meters. So that works out well. So why would I need a second kit? And these things cost about $50 US. I need a second kit because I'm using very oftentimes a dual channel receiver, which is gonna take two batteries. I've got two of these transmitters here, which use two batteries each. So we're up to six right there. And if this only comes with eight, I don't have a set of backups. So if I buy a second one of these, I'll have 16 AA's, I'll have four AAA's, probably more than I need, but that's fine. And I am also gonna get a second charger out of that, which means that I can have eight batteries charging and then eight in use if I need them. So I'm super excited about this kit. Um, I will report back to you later on about how well it's going. I'm not really concerned about it because the reviews are very, very high on this. And gone are my days of using these and going out and buying these 24 packs of batteries that I'm constantly replacing because I'm always worried that I'm gonna run out of them in my productions. So there you have it. We've got the Envelope Pro from Panasonic. And what I like about this is it's a complete kit because it comes with the case, eight rechargeable AA batteries, two rechargeable AAA batteries, the charger itself, and of course, I didn't mention this, the most important thing, which is that when you receive the kit, all of the batteries come pre-charged, ready to go. So that's what I got for you guys now. 
It's time for me to go prep a turkey. We're gonna be doing stuffing, mushrooms. There might be a few drinks happening. Don't forget to check out the links in the description below. Smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time on Gearbox.